George Wisher was a Scottish religious reformer and a Protestant martyr. His career as a Christian preacher began in the year 1544 when he traveled Scotland from east to west. The story has been told by one of his students, a very famous student named John Knox. George went from place to place, house to house, building to building, in danger of his life. He denounced the errors of the papacy and the abuses in the church at many places, including Montrose, Dundee, where he escaped an attempt on his life. In January of 1546, things became very dangerous for George, and he was seized by the Earl of Bothwell, and on the orders of Cardinal Beaton, he was taken to the Edinburgh Castle. It is said that when you leave Edinburgh, you leave nothing. There he was handed over to Cardinal Beaton, who had a show trial, which meant that they were already going to convict him. It was just a show. And John Lauder prosecuted George Wisher. They executed by burning him at the stake for his Christian faith at St. Andrews in March of 1546. I personally had stood on the spot where there is a stone in the street at the exact place where he was burnt at the stake. Facing the castle while burning, he said to Cardinal Beaton, he said, so you see me today, you will be in a few months. Well, you better listen to somebody when they're burning and they prophetically say something. Because the death of the Cardinal took place, it was true, and he was killed on May 29th of that year. Wishard's preaching helped popularize the teachings of John Calvin and others in Scotland. He translated into English the first confession of faith in 1536. At his trial, he recognized the priesthood of all believing Christians. He proclaimed that the true church was where the Word of God, the Bible, was faithfully preached. There is a wonderful memorial called the Martyrs Memorial at St. Andrews, right next to the famous old golf course there at St. Andrews, Scotland, the old course. It was erected to honor George Wisher and other martyrs who died for their faith in Christ during the Reformation era. <laughs>